All right. Uh, let me show you something I got in the mail recently that I'm about to uh, get into. A Pinewood Derby car or kit. Yeah, my daughter's in Girl Scouts, so we signed up for that. So I'm kind of looking forward to that, and in a way I'm kind of not. I have this weird feeling like... Like it's just going to be a competition of all the dads bragging about how fast their Pinewood car is, and I'm, not, I'm just not sure I care enough. Uh, but we'll see how that goes. We'll see how it goes. I'll report back. Maybe I'll make a video of uh, us coming in last place or something like that. Uh, but I wanted to kick off the new year and just say uh, thank you for tuning in. As always, Happy New Year. Happy Holidays. Hope your holiday time was nice and relaxing with uh, friends and family. I know it was for me. Very low-key, very relaxing. And uh, yeah, I just thought we'd make a quick little video here of some things I got. Uh, right before the holidays, I picked this guy up, Cobra Triangle. It's a uh, it's an isometric racing game on the NES. It's sort of like RC Pro Am, but on boats. Actually, it's more than just racing. I thought it was going to be purely racing, but it seems like every round is a little bit different. Sometimes there's different tasks. Yeah, it's not purely racing. And if I'm not mistaken, I think this and RC Pro Am were both developed by Rare don't know if I'm wrong about that. I might be wrong, but I might be right. And with that, uh, I wanted to show uh, this package here that I got in the mail from Nostalgia Lane. We did a trade recently. And uh, very, very uh, excited to show off what's in here. It's nothing too amazing, I don't think, unless there's something unexpected in here. Uh, that I'm not aware of, but, you know, let me just crack into this box and I'll explain in a moment. Ah. Yeah. So here we go. Oh no, there's extras. There's an extra game. Wasn't expecting that. Thank you, Terry. Holy cow. What do we have in here? Okay, let me try to shield the main contents. And what is this? There's a note. There is a note. Dad Racer, thanks again for the trade. You guys will love these. I'm not going to spoil it. Remember to look up the codes as they can be fun. And. Ba, ba, ba. Oop, that's. I don't want to spoil that. There's more to the note here. Wow. Wow. Thank you, Terry. Okay. All right. So, a little bit of context on what I have in front of me here. Donkey Kong Country is one of my favorite games on the Super Nintendo. On any given day, it's top five. It's always top ten to me. It's a fantastic platforming game to me. It's right up there. Okay, Love the game. Play through it at least once a year. Love the music. Love everything about it. But I've never played Donkey Kong Country 2 or 3. And finally, I decided that I had to get them and I was able to work out a trade with Nostalgia Lane for both of those. Really excited to play through these. I hear great things about Donkey Kong Country 2. I hear not so good things about Donkey Kong Country 3, but to me it's like, how bad can it be, right? I mean, this is sort of like a must and a big gap in my collection, especially for how much I love the original Donkey Kong Country. So thank you so much once again. By the way, beautifully clean copies. Check those out. Wow. Thank you, Terry. Thank you, Nostalgia Lane, for those. And uh, let's see what the extra is. I see a blue-colored game. Looks like it could be a PlayStation 4 game. It is... 
Wow, Kingdom Hearts HD, is that 2.8? It's a Roman numeral 2.8. I guess it's Kingdom Hearts HD 2.8 Final Chapter Prologue. Three Magical Experiences, The Evolution in Kingdom Hearts Graphics. Wow, super cool. Let's, let's read the note over here. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy some Kingdom Hearts together too. I hear they can be quite fun for the kids too. We haven't gone that route yet ourselves, so let me know what you think, Nostalgia Lane. Wow. Terry, you didn't have to do this. This is awesome. My daughter's going to love this. Thank you, Terry. I mean... She likes Disney stuff. From what I understand, you know what the funny thing is? I was just talking the other day with uh, Cam, Modern Retro Renaissance, and Ask the Cheese Gaming about Kingdom Hearts games. I don't know how that came up, but we talked about Kingdom Hearts games. And this is like the biggest coincidence ever. Now I have a Kingdom Hearts game to play. I've never played through any of them. I am aware of them. I think looks like it's developed by Square Enix. So it's like Final Fantasy characters meet Disney characters. I don't know why this exists, but there's a whole there's a whole series apparently. So yeah, this is going to be awesome. And you know how much I love the PS4. So this is going to be a good time. Uh, Thank you so much, Terry, and thank you for tuning in. Quick video today, but I'll be back real soon. Take care.